Hi everyone, um, I'm Gareth and this is my colleague Jilly. We're both ex-primary school teachers and part of the education team with CleverTouch. And CleverTouch are really proud to announce the launch of the latest update to Lynx Whiteboard. That's our free to use presentation software, Lynx 8. Eight reasons to love Lynx 8 are the series of videos that you're now watching one of and we hope you enjoy them. Welcome to Lynx Whiteboard and another reason of why we love Lynx 8. Lynx Whiteboard is a cloud-based platform. You can save your files directly onto your Lynx cloud and share them with colleagues and students or you can sync other accounts to it such as your OneDrive, your SharePoint, Google Drive and Dropbox. It's also a single sign-on so you're not going to have to have lots of different logins and passwords really easy to connect to and I'll show you that in a little bit as well. Now Lynx Whiteboard comes with its own cloud and you can create organisations to share work with your colleagues, departments and your students and we'll have a little look in that in more detail in a moment but you can see here that we've got some teacher groups, not in teacher groups and then some of our resources that we have shared here as well. So let's go out to our browser. So this is linkscloud.app and this is where you can download it to multiple different devices as well. But I'm going to have a look at just signing in, like I said, with the single sign on or you can use a QR code if it's signed in securely on your mobile phone. So I'm just going to quickly pop my email in with the password and I'm then signed in. This is also where I can create my organizations. By clicking on the logo at the top, I can create an organization. So I've got one created there as well, but all you need to do, click on it, you can go into your cloud, give it a name, fill in your details, and then you can add users to it as well. And you can give them groups if you want to. So you might have a teaching group and you might have your student groups there as well. I'm going to have a look in my drive. So once I click on my drives here, so you can see I've got multiple drives all open. So I've got my Google Drive, got OneDrive, I've got my organization. I can add more Google Drives. I've got my Dropbox and I've got SharePoint there as well. Now, the one thing I'm going to show you here, I've got my Lynx Cloud. So if I click on my Lynx Cloud, you can see I've got some content in there. The great thing about the Lynx Cloud is I can go into it and I can share my lessons live and work collaboratively with other students and they don't have to be on the same network or even in the same classroom. So just creating my live document here. It'll bring up a little QR code and all I need to do is scan that QR code on my device and then that will open up what is on my board so if I just go to connect I've got the same that's on my board I'll just start to present this so I'll go in to start my presentation what I can also do is I can give permission to my students away from the classroom so now I can roll my dice on the board so it's got the number nine and then I can reveal tile number nine so I can continue to do that to reveal the different parts so we've got number eight and we can reveal those different parts of the picture there of our lovely Lynx logo 